What is discernment? Hebrews 5.14 suggests that those who are mature have their powers of discernment trained by constant practice to distinguish good from evil. Spurgeon explained it's not knowing the difference between right and wrong, but knowing the difference between right and almost right. Discernment is a gift of the Holy Spirit. The Greek word used for discernment in Hebrews is the same word used in 1 Corinthians 12. Among the spiritual gifts, one of them is an ability to distinguish between spirits. 1 John 4 1 says that not every spirit is from God, and we are to test the spirits, for many false prophets have gone out into the world. It's popular to think of discernment as recognizing false teachers, but more specifically, it's spiritual warfare, knowing the spirit of truth from the spirit of error. We must remember that our battle is not against flesh and blood, but against spiritual forces. We are to correct opponents with gentleness, for it is God who grants repentance, leading to the truth and away from the devil's snares. All Christians should be discerning, but some, by a gifting of the spirit, are more discerning than others. They are a benefit to their church. At least they're supposed to be. Like all spiritual gifts, even discernment can be abused. We often think of the Apostle Paul rebuking the Corinthians for behaving like wild charismaniacs, but he also rebuked them for boasting in their knowledge. It is because of God that you are in Christ Jesus, who became to us wisdom from God, so that, as it is written, let the one who boasts, boast in the Lord. Knowledge puffs up, but love builds up. So let us use our gifts from God in loving service to one another, when we understand the text.